Hello, I'm Garrett Rochelle with iTech and welcome to Quick Tips with Garrett. In this video, I just wanted to do a quick overview of how to download the Acumatica mobile app and how to do the initial setup so that you can gain access to what's really a very useful tool that Acumatica has provided. Uh, now, one quick thing, I'm doing this on my iPhone. If you're an Android user, the process is going to be identical with the one exception of you'll be using the Android App Store as where we will be using the Apple App Store. So we're going to go into the App Store here. And as you can see down here, I went to search in the bottom right and I typed in Acumatica in the search bar here and it brings up the Acumatica app. Now this button here for you will say get and you'll click that button. You'll put in any Apple ID password that you need to and it will download for you. Once that download happens, you'll see this Acumatica icon on your phone. So we can click into that. And when we click into it, it brings us into our login page. Now for me, it's showing the last company that I was in. Uh, for you, it'll be blank. And the way that we're going to add our account is down on the very bottom here, there's this accounts button. So when we click on this, it takes us to a list of accounts that we have access to. For you, it'll likely be just the one uh, that we're adding now. It's a little longer for me, uh, but here on the bottom right, we will go to this add account button. So when we click on this, it's bringing us to a, a screen here where it wants our Acumatica URL and a manual description or a custom description that we can type in ourselves. Now, one thing to note, the URL that I'm about to put in is going to be a little longer and more complicated than yours. That's just due to the fact that I'm working out of a demo company that we've built so the URL is a little different. For your purposes, your URL is going to be very similar to these where it's company.acumatica.com, company.acumatica.com, and so on. So we're going to go here. I'm going to put in my URL. I'm going to do a quick paste to save time there. And then I'm going to put in my description of sandbox 2020 R1. And then we're going to hit next. Now, when we do this, it brings us to our login page again, this time for our specific company. The first time that we do the login on the mobile app, it's going to re require us to completely put in our username and our password. Uh, once we do it going forward, after we've logged in, we should have the option, depending on the phone that we have, to use the face ID or fingerprint option to make it much quicker. So I'm going to put in my password now. It's going to be blocked out, I believe, for security purposes, but I did put in a password. So now that we have username and password, we're going to hit login. And this is going to bring us into the Acumatica mobile app and all the neat little features that it holds. Now we're going to do another video that's going to outline a lot of the, the detail of the Acumatica mobile app and how to make best use of it. But for this video, uh, the goal is to show you where to get it and how to get into it. So the one last thing I want to show you is up in the top left, if we click this, we're going to be able to sign out. So it takes us back to the login page. One thing that's a little different now is on the bottom of the login page, you've got this face ID option. So now rather than doing the entire username and password, we can go straight down to the face ID. I'm going to hit that. It's going to recognize my face and bring me straight into the mobile app there. So that's just a basic overview of where and how to download the Acumatica mobile app and how to do the initial setup so that you can actually get into it. Uh, we will be doing further videos with more detail on how best to use the Acumatica mobile app. But for now, I want to thank you for joining and be sure to check out iTech's YouTube channel for more quick tips with Garrett. Thank you.